Hi, welcome to Robojax. In this video, I'm going to introduce this 3 ampere pulse width modulation DC motor controller. So this is a device and I have a DC motor. This can handle up to 3 ampere. So we were going to test it with the motor and also we are going to test it with actual DC load. We are going to see if it can handle a 3 ampere with a 12 volts on actual DC resistance. So I don't want to have to make a lot of noise. So we will measure it. So on oscilloscope also I'm going to show you the waveform to see if uh, how it behaves as we increase the speed of a motor. The module is sold around $9 US on Amazon and here is the size as you can see 32 millimeter by 50 millimeter and the depth is about 15 millimeter. So this is the actual module. It has a, a knob and the knob is uh, soldered very solidly so you don't have to worry that it will rip off or something because it's very solid and also we have a heat thing here that is uh, attached to the um, main power controller now we have very powerful uh, high capacity capacitors at the output to make it cleaner and then so it has been labeled clearly power minus and power plus so these two are input so and then positive and negative for the motor is out so these two so that's good they put two positive inside and and we have also four screws in case if you are if you want to install it somewhere and then we have also an LED indicator that shows that we have power so so the response is very good uh, and linear as I can see but we have to see it on oscilloscope so I, I will hold this now you can see the the current even the motor is stopped so we have about 100 milliampere that's normal so now let me just increase it so the amount of current that you see on this screen here this this current is uh, determined by the power of the motor so that was 2.9 ampere but uh, i will have actual dc load that can draw 3 ampere so after this now i'm gonna connect it to this i have an electronic load connected so we are going to see if the 3 ampere uh, if this can supply 3 ampere to this load So now the voltage is 4 volts and the ampere is 3.4 so I'm just So as you can see here 3 ampere and it's at 4 volts As I increase it And the maximum that's 11.88 so that's the 3 ampere so with 3 ampere nothing the temperature is very n normal so 27 degrees turn it off so let me just change this to 4 4 ampere and go now it's 4 ampere maximum So when I reduce that voltage the current increases because this load is not properly acting so now it's 4 ampere 1 ampere above the rating still 26 degrees that's a room temperature so absolutely nothing, Co totally, totally at room temperature.
26 degrees so let me change it to 5 ampere and let me reduce it to see if the Five ampere. I feel a little warmth, as you can see again. Same, same thing. So let me reduce, uh, let me increase it six. So. I've corrected the voltage now it's 12 volts 6 ampere 26 27 degrees that's the maximum so let me change it to 7 and then on at 7 amp So my power supply makes that noise, so this is not from here. A little warm, 29 degrees. But not much difference. That is dissipation of 70 watt. My voltage. So 80 watt now. Now it's around 30 degrees, a little warmer. 30 degrees centigrade, 86 Fahrenheit. I will leave it for one minute. One minute test. Now let's go for nine. Now we have one nine amp. Now it's controlling nine amp. A little warm up, so 35 now. The module is a little warmer. I see the temperature here. I feel it. So. So let me make it 10. Now it's fully 10 ampere. 10 and 12 volts, so 9.99, that's 10 amp. So if I reduce it, that's maximum. So let me see. That's 118 watt, so 33 degrees. So conclusion is that the, this is the best uh, motor controller that you can get with this price. Very durable, I've tested it up to 10 amp, so 3 ampere is nothing for this, it can do it. Even you can go for 5 or 8 ampere very easily, but I've not tested it for longer periods of time, so I don't know if long in longer period what it does, but for sure if it can handle 10 amps for a few, for a minute or so, 
So 5 amp and 3 amp will be nothing if it runs continuously. Please thumb up the video, please share it and also subscribe to my channel to get updates of upcoming videos. Thank you for watching.